Hey guys, Casey the Hut here, representing the Hut Cartel with some Americana. Going back to civilian life. February 1946. Contents. As poignant today as it was then. Personal problems. That's a uh, that's that's code for uh, don't come home with the PTSD and beat your wife. <laughs> This is an important thing today, too, with all that stolen valor stuff that people, you know, uh, psychosis that America is in, and these, these children that have been born into a never-ending war, you know. I used to be the key. Oh, women. Huh, you get like two sentences. <laughs> if you are a woman, <laughs> no talking about trans or anything here, huh? In a nutshell, what about a job? Do you want your old job back? <laughs> this is awesome. I love this book. This is, makes me happy every time I leaf through it. I was just looking through my stuff today and I found it and I just had to share this. Do you want a government job?
additional facts for your future. Like, you know, see the flash, duck and cover. <laughs> no joke. <laughs> Surplus government property and federal rigs. What the Disabled Veteran Should Know. Now here is a very good chapter. If you're discharged or separated with a disability due to service, <laughs> doesn't that look happy? Your C number. Emergency financial assistance. Now this is nice. If you should need emergency financial assistance between the time you are separated from the service and the time you claim in this, your claim is decided by the Veterans Administration, you may be able to get through your local chapter of the Red Cross. Assistance may be grant or by loan, depending on your apparent ability to repay. It is made for such needs as shelter, food, clothing, and fuel. Application for such assistance should be made to the local chapter of the Red Cross. Help in securing benefits to which you or your family may be entitled is also provided. Now, that is some awesome shit. They don't do that for us anymore. <laughs> That's for sure. Get that boot. Gone. Here's a hot topic, government insurance. <laughs> I work with the burial benefits. Shout out to, you know, rest in peace, Judge Miller. Miller's Vets. And we are now reintegrated into society. Hooray!